Today I have uh, convened the uh, European Union ministers offering a first for an emergency ad hoc meeting here in New York after knowing that President Putin has announced another major escalation in the war he has launched against Ukraine. It's clear that Putin is trying to destroy Ukraine. He's trying to destroy the whole country by different means since he is failing military. He's announcing a partial mobilization in Russia to support the organization of a illegal referenda, they call it referenda, in the Ukrainian territories occupied by Russia, and by threatening again again and again, and this time very clearly, on, on a quite unveiled manner, the use of weapons of mass destruction. Additional restrictive measures against Russia will be brought forward immediately, as soon as possible, in coordination with our partners. And I want to stress in particular one important element. In line with United Nations Charter and international law, Ukraine is exercising its legitimate right to defend itself against the Russian aggression to regain full control of its territory and has the right to liberate occupied territories within its internationally recognized borders. And for that, we will continue supporting Ukraine's efforts to provision of military equipment as long as it takes.